What's going on guys, National Master James Canty the third here, and today we're looking at a nasty mate in the C3 Cecile for the kill. C3 Cecilia, let me show y'all what happened. So first off, y'all see we had a big boy at FM. He was a little bit stronger, 25 plus. Of course, we took a few of them points from him, but FM, right? So we hitting this man with the C3 Cecile for the kill. So here we go, E4. Here it is, E4, C5, and then we go C3. Same, same, the usual, right? Knight of six, E5. Uh, knight d5 knight of three guys this is all the stuff you're gonna see in the playlist of course we got the course as well the, the course honestly i don't know when i'm gonna change it back to 40 dollars, but right now it's still 20 dollars. you can get the course right under the video guys but it, it i explained everything c3 cecile for the kill right knight c6 d4 snap snap okay this is all regular then he plays d6 right now usually you you can play bishop c4 here bishop c4 is one of the main moves you also have captures. I think e6 has been played, but I like to play the knight c3 one, and you do have the choice of taking the pawn or taking the knight, which both of them, even the, the pawn one is what's recommended, but you have some in games that are slightly double-edged. Black has a slightly better in game. White has to play dynamically. I got a draw against uh, international master Keaton Kiera, something like that from uh, from uh, Cali, San Francisco, actually. I think, he's San, San, I think he's San Francisco, something like that, but I know he's from, um, from Cali. And I did get a uh, draw with him over the board with the white pieces after the D takes E5 line. But a lot of people like to take on C3 and then take on E5 like he did and then D5. So now after D5, of course, 95 loses on the spot, big fella, on the spot. Okay, so and actually uh, 95, let me just show you 95. This is covered in the chorus, Bishop B5, and we live. Bishop b5 and we lie. Very easy. And then after bishop d7, there's queen a4, hitting a5 and hitting d7 at the same time. b6 because the queen's overloaded. So if you do anything else, like if you try to do bishop takes here, queen takes, then of course here, and we take this this one. So uh, b6 is the best, and then knight takes e5, hitting d7, gg, start a new game. That's really it. So here we go, guys. Here we go. d5, he goes knight b8. Cool. I always take on e5, expecting knight d7, and game is over after knight d7. Uh, well, not it's not over, but I play bishop b5 to pin the knight. Usually a6 comes. I actually just show y'all on the board. Knight d7, bishop b5, and we live. a6, and then hit this man with a move. Queen f3! Oh my goodness. And then f6, and then queen h5, and we live. Queen h5 and we live. Game's over. G6, knight takes, takes, and then there's me. This is gross. This is this is gross. Let's just get that off the screen. So let, let's come back here, though. It actually, actually didn't do that. Now, after knight takes, uh, what did he play? He played g6. Yeah. So this g6 line is a little weird. I rarely get it. I rarely ever get it. So I hit him with check anyway to see what he was going to do. He played knight d7, and here we go, guys. Queen d4 is actually probably not the best move i mean i i really didn't actually check with the engine i'm going to check later but queen d4 i like it because i saw something i had to pause right there you know queen d4 i saw something right so this is going to be real fun to watch right here queen d4 what are you expecting black to do you black in, the, in this game what are you expecting to see here we play g6 to play what raise your hand class yes it should be bishop to g7 bam there it is Bishop g7, and here it is, man. Y'all ready? Let me roll my sleeves up for this one. What you gonna do? F4, bishop f4, take on d7 with the bishop. Here it is. You ready? I play knight takes d7. Oh my goodness, hit that man with a move. What do you mean? How is that even a move? What is you even talking about right now? Your queen's hanging. Yeah, it is. He takes it. We hit that man with knight f6, and we put him on sticks. And then king f8, and then bishop h6, all in the mix. And that's mate. That's mate, and we great. Oh my goodness, that's beautiful. That's beautiful. Look at that again. Knight takes d7, and I saw this too. I was like, oh, that's mate. Hit that man with a move. He took my queen. Double check. He has to move the king because it's check here with the knight, and it's check with the bishop. He goes here, and then bishop h6, and it's over. Like, literally, you can't move anywhere. I was so hyped. It was so nice that even him, he was like, ooh. He, he, he put it in the chat. You know, in your little chess.com chat, he was like, ooh, and I was like, thanks, bro. And then we played another one, I went out one too. But it was it was very strong. Like it was just sweet to be able to see this. I mean, this is honestly, this is a first. This is a first in a C3 Cecil for the kill. So whenever I get something cool, I gotta show you guys, put it in the playlist. Make sure y'all check out the playlist. It's right above. Y'all can see that here on the channel, guys. But I mean, I had to show y'all this quick miniature because it was sweet here. I mean, from the top, one more time here, right? E4, C5, and we live. Uh, C3, knight C, uh, oh, yeah, here we go. Okay. C5, C3, knight of 6, E5, knight D5, knight of 3, knight C6, D4, snap, snap, D6, knight C3, snap, snap, 
takes and d5 and we live knight b8 take only five knight d7 or actually he didn't play knight d7 he played g6 here which is sort of one of the unusual moves to make in this position bishop check knight d7 queen d4 because i think he has to play f6 but who wants to play f6 right now right like literally who wants to play f6 nobody i mean you could play rook g8 as well but uh bishop g7 looks right it's pinning it but you got to see that line all the time knight takes bishop takes hit him hit him Oh my goodness, get him off the board. It's a family channel. Bishop takes and Bishop h6 is beautiful, guys. So this is something that you can use in your own games for all my C3 Cecile for the kill players. Thank you so much for watching this video. I had to share it with you guys. So make sure you guys like, subscribe, share the video, put comments, all the other stuff, and let me know how you like the video, guys. And I'll see you on the next one.